hitting in the seventh spot. Shows you how good that order is. Here's a bouncer hit to the second baseman. And in time, Petty to Febri to retire the Speedy McClinic. Lifted high in the air to right field. Busby is under it and makes the play to end the inning. So Team USA puts a couple runners on, but nothing across. Oklahoma State gets their first. She making sure she's communicating well with Monroe behind the dish. But she's always also trying to figure out where that zone is. Can she extend it on the edges of the plate? So far, that outside pitch not really coming in for a strike as of yet. She was instrumental in the win over Alabama. Home run and a double against the Tide. Runner going, throw to second, and it's on the money. Monroe throws out. Naomi trying to steal the bag right on the money with that one. Monroe back behind the dish, just amazing catcher. You're going to say amazing about each of these players, but a, able to control the game from behind the plate. Did I almost stole on Team USA. I can take it against most of the teams within my conference. And a swing and a miss, and Pennington strikes out. So they do get a base runner. Runner caught stealing. And Abbott does. Strike on the corner. Good pitch. And Reed caught looking. And Maxwell has impressed here through the first two innings. Runner. I've seen anything like Monica Abbott either. Here's the 2-2. Lined into right field, a good at bat for Busby. Throw to first, and she's out. Moultrie to Arioto to retire Busby. And she looks a little stunned after that play, and that's Team USA stepping up their defense. Hard hit to right field. You cannot take for granted that that's a base hit. Just because it makes the grass does not mean anything. Michelle Moultrie, a big one, comes in hard, charges it. And gets the out at one. Hits it hard. Right at the third baseman, Pennington. The hot corner, and number 21 steps up to end the inning. So Oklahoma State doing the job. Solid pitching, good defense, and we're still scoreless. Two and a half in the books. But all fall, Coach had her at the top of the lineup to build confidence. And she paints the corner for another strikeout. That's four in the game now for Abbott. Starting to heat up. And that one drops low in the zone. And Springfield chases it and strikes out. That's five. Well, what we're seeing, is Dominguez was three for four in that matchup. Strike three called on the corner. And Abbott does strike out the side. She has struck out six now. And in a groove in the circle. Well, reinvent yourself every inning. Well, how about you just strike out the side? Monica Abbott, so tough in the circle. And that's lined into right field and down the line for Moultrie. On her way to second, and that'll be a ground rule double. Moultrie jumping on that pitch. In a typical ballpark, I would assume that would be a triple, but because there is no fence that extends all the way over to catch that ball, it goes out of play. It's recorded as a ground rule double. Hit that stays fair down that right field line. So hard to get him out. Not only is she fast, but that placement puts it back in that right field corner, the furthest spot away from a throw to third base. Here's Bubba Nichols, and there's a wild pitch. That got away from the freshman throw down to third, and in there safely is Moultrie. Well, check out Dominguez back behind the dish, able to come away with that one really quick and make it kind of tight and what that causes is different release point and she walks Nichols so Bubba has walked a couple times runners now test her skills now and figure out what she needs to work on 2-2 two -two is low bounces away from the catcher here comes Moultrie throw to the plate no throw made as her speed gets Team USA their first run Nichols moves over to third one nothing Team USA in front And there's ball four. That one bounces away. Here comes Nichols, and it's 2-0. So some pitches low in the dirt prove problematic here for Oklahoma State. 
you never want to miss a change up high in the zone, but you definitely able to be a first team All-American in your freshman year. That's impressive, knowing what you have coming against you. Popped up against the world champ, and the second baseman has it, flipping, retiring Naomi. Still with their teams, Ken Erickson, the sole coach for Team USA. Febri diving for it is flipping. What a play to take a hit away from Febri. Four to three on the putout. It's great range by Flippin. Ground ball into that 3-4 hole. A one hopper. That's the benefit of being able to play second base. Sydney Pennington pulls that one on the ground to third. Nichols in time to end the inning. A 1-2-3 frame for Monica Abbott. Still nothing across for Oklahoma State. 2-0. Team USA in front. We move. 2017. Two-time All-American. Hits it into left, base hit. She has reached three times, couple singles in this one. Give this at bat right here. Oh, and missed, and then the helmet pops off of Ariotto. She's okay, it appears. So completely unintentional. All that was happening was she was taking her base on the walk and the throw was coming from the catcher back to the pitcher. But she walked in that line of sight, or that throwing lane. Here's the payoff pitch. That's hit hard into the gap in right center. It's going to run to the fence. Couple run score. Aguilar and Arioto and a double for Moultrie, and it's 4 nothing. Two doubles now for Michelle Moultrie. Moultrie seems to be in the perfect spot in the lineup. Not only does she seem to be a great leadoff, which is what she did with her first double back in the fourth, but here with runners in scoring position, able to just lace this one straight to center. Does not have a strikeout since the third inning when she strike, struck out the side. And there is on cue strikeout number seven. First out of the inning the game slap hitters runners on the base pass there's a check swing and another strikeout eight K's now for Abbott <laughs> you talk of get her out of her rhythm and another strikeout she strikes out the side for the second time and has nine K's now in the game Monica Abbott and Team USA rolling Strikes out the side, the last two with that amazing rise ball. Monica Abbott really feeling in the circle. Putting forth an A-plus effort in this game. 2-2, two -two. bouncer to the third baseman. Nichols in time, there's one down. Now batting for Oklahoma State, the first baseman number one, Allison Fiebre. The road to Tokyo, Japan. And you mentioned how Japan is the team to keep a close eye on. 70 games in 36 cities. That's a lot of mileage. It is. And look at how many miles they have to go. But when it, she chose another school originally. A Georgia grad transfer. They're glad to have her strikes out there. That's 10 Ks now. For Abbott and trying to close the door here. The 0 2 strikeout, a no hitter for Monica Abbott. She allows just one base runner, a walk to Kylie Naomi to open up the game in the first inning, and a no no. And Team USA, a 4 0 victory over Oklahoma State. Team USA on the tour looking to make themselves ready for Tokyo. And right there, a 4 0 victory over Oklahoma State. 11 strikeouts for Abbott, and they improved to 9 0. Oklahoma State excited about their run early season as they gear up for the big.